if you'll just give me a little bit of time. I understand, yeah, a little, a little extra time. I do recognize that I am quite late. I, I, rec- I promise you, I, I recognize that I am quite late. But, uh, yes. We're here. I'm back. Like, I'm here. I'm back. After, uh, oh, yeah. In in case you don't follow me on Twitter, let me actually start with this. Let me start with this. Uh, yeah, let me just start with this so I can get out of the way. Um, where is it? This one. Of course, now Toucan is gonna fuck it. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Let me just go ahead and start off with this. Yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, there you go. I did say 3 p.m., but it's 3.15, so... I mean, but I'm still here. So, uh... Yeah! I, so this happened. Uh, I promise... I'm fine. I I promise you, I'm okay. Everything's good. Like I feel I feel 100% fine. Everything's functioning normally. So please don't worry. Everything is okay. Like everything's fine. And we will continue Everything is everything will continue as normal. As we normally do. So, if you'll allow me for a second, I am coming back. I did say that I was going to start playing Pokemon and stuff, but, like, I still want to give myself a little bit of leeway on the on the weekends. So, the weekends, I think I'm just going to do grab bag stuff now. I think what my plan is, is that if I'm difficult to see, hold on, let me check just a bit. No, I'm not tough to see quite yet. Sun hasn't gone down yet. But, um... It might well be. It's cloudy as hell outside. Anyway, what I was going to say was, I think weekends are definitely going to be my more grab bag kind of streams where I just kind of play what I feel like playing. Whereas Sunday will probably still be my football manager days with my friends. But, oh yeah, I've been growing up for like two years. Um, But yeah, so the week- the weekday streams, which will probably, which will continue to be Monday, Tuesday, and uh, Thursday, I'll continue. I'll continue a uh, Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. But as for Saturday, this is just kind of my whatever day. This is my I'll play whatever I want to play day, and my whatever what I want to play today just so happens to be what I've been playing on every other stream that I've just kind of done a grab bag stream. Yeah, I'm playing more pro wrestling sim today <laughs> because I love it. It's a it's a fun game. It's a it's a great time sink for me considering how much I love professional wrestling. And I'm now starting to like learn how the game works and everything, so I might be able to mod it soon, which is gonna be which should be fun. So I gotta familiarize myself with where we left off last. With DPW, with my baby, uh dumbass pro. Where did we leave off? Just on regular episodes? Ah yes. We left we last left on the last on the last stream we had our first episode our uh, last major show it's summer why is it still foggy um because i can't think of a better name for it oh wait hold on one sec is we oh crap oh that's the elgato f- oh, whoopsie yeah i i forgot to set that back cuz i'm so used to uh i'm so used to playing with uh the capture stuff, but now that I'm back to the screen, I forgot to change it back. Anyway, so yeah, now I just kind of need to <clears throat> get myself back going, build towards the next big show, and I'm actually gonna like try to book real shows this time because I typically have uh, I typically have like a track record of just coming into this and just like letting that letting the uh, the AI book the show, but I'm actually gonna try to do it myself this time. Because <clears throat> it's no, there's no fun in just sitting and watching an AI do stuff. Just considering the fact that I have been 
Uh, I've been doing that basically for the past, like, couple times I've played this game. It's, um... Uh, the past couple times I've played this game, I've, uh... I tend to take. I tend to let the robot take the take the take the reins, and I just kind of sit back and watch what happens. But not today. I'm actually gonna play and try to do some good wrestling. I'm gonna try my best to actually book some good shows. Okay. Now I have to now I have to familiarize myself with just everything. It's been friggin' ages. Right. That okay, good. I don't know what to do first. <laughs> this is the only it's the only slight issue. I th think if I'm gonna have let's try to run this let's try to run this legit. Like a real like a real promotion running real stories. So, if I were a major company, how would I do this? We'd probably have some kind of longer build up to the next major show, which is quite a ways away. It's at least 13 weeks, if not more. So, let's maybe figure out who's challenging for what. So, hello, Bobcat. I'm actually playing. I'm actually playing pro wrestling sim today. I'm not just simulating this time. Okay. I'm trying to think. Where do I start? So obviously, Silicon Valley stupidity is what we're going. Is what our next major show is. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen shows in between then. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um trying to think. Or okay, fourteen weeks. I'm trying to think fourteen shows to book. I'm thinking about it one of two ways. I could either just have one super long build to the next major show or I could go seven weeks and have like on the August 1st so like one two three four five six seven and on that seventh show and on this seventh show right here we'll do we'll do like a proto show like a proto takeover show where everything is uh where everything's on the line and where yeah where everything's on the line and then we'll just uh and then we'll go from there for Silicon Valley Stupidity, which is, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, okay, so. <coughs> my, uh, sorry, my throat's tickling a little bit. So that's just the way. This isn't, this is normal for me, though. Like, um, 100% normal. So... This is like this cough it has nothing to do with it has nothing to do with COVID. Promise, this is normal for me. It, this happens all the time, but um, it doesn't matter. That's not important right now. So I'm thinking. I've already I've already showed off what what was going on. Hobbs is the world champion. Hobbs is the say Hobbs is the world champion. Bailey is the women's champion. And Jordan Grace is the Twitch champion, which is the intergender championship. It's it's not the only it's not the only match it can be uh it's not the only kind of match it can be defended in, but it's preferable. I gotta I gotta really refamiliarize myself with my roster hierarchy and just everything. Right. It seems to be an issue that I have. It seems to be an issue that I have where things are just kind of uneven. I need a main, I need another main event lady. I need another main event lady. Maybe that'll be the maybe that'll be the matchup for Silicon Valley Stupidity. And that'll be Bailey's challenger. Um Ah. Okay. 
I think she did. I think I. I think she finally did win. Yeah, on paper, that's the problem. On paper and in execution, it's it's different because Chris Masters. Hey, thanks for the follow, by the way. I can't see the name, but thank you very much. Um, Chris Masters, not very good on paper. He's uh, I mean. Also, like, where is he in the the rankings here for the men? Obviously, on paper, it looks like it should be Brody King, but I'm fairly certain we've done Brody King, like, enough now. His Chris Masters is down, like, quite a bit. And some of these guys are only on here because of the... Speedball hasn't won a match for me yet. That might have to change. Um, some of these guys are only on here, like, uh, ZSJ, Trent, Chuck Taylor. These guys are only on here because, uh, because of my relationship with PWG. Uh, yeah, he's, he's low on these, he's low on these rankings. Out of everybody that I have, he's, like, the highest of everyone who's, like, not an enhancement talent. And I'm fairly certain. Let me do all time here. She has won a match. Cool, I can get rid of that note now. I forgot I did that too. Was that at the pay-per-view or was that the show before the pay-per-view? I need to check. I need to know. I think it was at the show before the pay-per-view. Because she, yeah, she just went up against Kylie Ray here. When did she? Yeah, she's not She's not had a great track record with me. Now I got to, god damn it. Now I got to figure out when she, when she won. Oh, this is a very, uh. No, oh, nope, that's not the one. I thought it was that one. I know she I know she beat her. I know she beat Brandy Loren. I just need to remember I just need to see when. When it happened. It wasn't on this one. Oh, that was an interview. I was like, wait, I got really confused for a second. I'm like, what the fu oh. It's an interview. I know. It's times like this when I'm glad that, um, Bobcat, it's times like this where I'm glad that Eve doesn't watch my streams because if, if she saw one in 41 with Willow, she'd want to murder me and I'm not, I don't want to fight her off, bruh. To be totally honest, it's the AI's fault. I could just, I could totally just blame the AI. Where is it? No, that's Mia. Where the hell? I was like, I want her to win, but like, to be fair, I don't think her stats are that good. I, I think they're passable, but I don't think they're, I don't think they're that good. I'll have to check when we're done here. When I, when I see what happened, when I, uh, I, I think her, I think her stats just aren't good. Was it at this show? No. DP dub Twitch. No, it wasn't this show. When the hell was it? I know it. I know. I Oh, God. This is going to bother me now. I put her in this match specifically. Uh, you know what? This is probably why Speedball doesn't win matches for me. Because I don't put him in one-on-one. -on -one, I don't put him in one-on-one -on -one matches. I, I should probably do that more. <laughs> Whoops. When did it happen? It's bothering me. I need to find it. Hold on. Let me... Let me do the rankings. Hold it. Women's... No, it wasn't in 2024. It was in 2023. Okay. We have something to work off of. We have something to work off of here. Good. It wasn't that one. That's... uh. Actually, it might have been that one. I don't know. I know... Did... It... I feel like it definitely happened at a major show. I... Don't remember which one, but I remember... Ah, it was this one. It was it was at Caged in the Central Valley. It was at Caged in the Central Valley 2023 is when she beat Brandy Loren inside a steel cage to fucking win it. It was Bailey's debut, if I, if, I, uh, if I recall correctly. It was either Bailey's debut or it was her second show. I th yeah, I think it was her second... I think it was, it was her second show. <laughs> The note, please. It'd be so great. Realistically, I could just look at the news and be like, when did I sign her again? 
I think I will. Hmm. Okay. Maybe this is just a... I, th I think we're probably not in the news because it's... Uh... I think it's probable that we're not in the news because it's just our promotion. <clears throat> you know what? I can just do this. When did I sign her? God damn it. Okay. Um, pff, that didn't help. Uh, what are Willow's stats? Okay. I think the AI sim, I think it decides Hobbs and Bandito. That's, I'll put a pin in that. Um, <clears throat> I'm trying to think here. What does it say most of the time when it says, uh, when I say, like, if I'm going to do this, it's auto. It says it will decide based on worker popularity and skills. That's probably why she doesn't win because her popularity is low. Her skills are fine. Like, her skills are fine, but, like, there's no reason that she should be, that she should be losing matches to, like, a Sky Blue or something because her stats do not justify that, like, in the slightest. Like, no way this should be happening. So, that's probably why it's it's all a matter of the uh, of the popularity. Like, if I go to yeah, speedball's also at like nineteen, which is like low. So fucking that's what uh that's the problem. All right, now, um, let's book the shows, baby. Is there anyone who's going to be willing to lose to, to Willow? Because I'm giving Willow a win right fucking now. I already know for a fact that, um, I think I'm going to have to do face versus face here because I know that Brandy Loren is fussy about losing. Even though she's listed as an enhancement talent, she's fussy about losing. So, let's give it, let's give it seven. I want Willow to win, damn it. Um, no, not, the, not those. Um, let's do that. There you go. See, we're already booking Willow to win. Because, god damn it, we're all tired of her losing. Um... From there, we will... Okay, Rod, Rod's working. Good. We'll have Speedball and... Who's in the lower card? Is a, let's do Chris. Let's check. Stats. Chris, 68, 74... Mike Bailey, seventy six, eighty two. So he's Mike Bailey is good. Going into so you guys have Willow start riffing off win after win after win. Perhaps I might do that. That's that's good. There you go. Yeah, let's do that. Um, yeah. <clears throat> it's all a matter of what. I'll let, I'll let the AI decide that one. Start 
Now let's do a Hobbs match versus poor old Boopinder. We're going to have Hobbs like fucking ruin Boopinder over here. Make him look like a, a wrecking man. Let's make him look like a wrecking machine. <laughs> Then after that, we will have seven three. Hmm, not bad. Let's do yeah. Let's do Bandito versus Fatu. Have it go. Fifteen minutes. Steal the show. Let's let Bandito win it. <clears throat> we'll have Bandito we'll have Bandito win it and then in an angle after the match um, I should actually probably set up the storyline now then if I want to do that Hobbs and Bandito and from there, we will have a, not a match. Well, I'll I'll um I'll I'll uh, tweak this later. So then, no, that's not the interviewee. I am the interviewer. And then we will have <clears throat> Bedito do an interview. We'll at least uh, start an interview with me. That's going to devolve to a promo by Bandito on Mr. William Hobbs. Maybe not that long. I'm going to go like that. Then uh, we'll probably... We actually might have... We'll have it there. And then we'll have... Uh... Okay, hold on. We'll have the ladies after that. We'll have Speedball first. <clears throat> then Bandito. Then um, we'll have the women's match. Then the angle with Bandito. And right before the main event of... Ugh, he's not that good. Um, fuck it. Ryan Nemeth and Terry Thatcher, because why not? We'll have... There's no stare down one. Damn. Um. We'll do. Just an attack. Actually. Um. I could probably, uh. I can probably adjust this a little bit more. Something like that. Right. Okay. Actually, yeah, I'll do that.
I do like to use captions to kind of... I do like to use captions to uh, kind of tell where the story is going. Then... Okay. Let's do the show. Okay, Chris beats Mike Bailey. Which sucks. <clears throat> Obviously, Bandito wins in a four-star contest. Man, he's just good. He's just real good. Willow wins. We are always happy about that. And then we have the... <clears throat> the first actual story. The first actual part of the story. And we got Hobbs and Bupinder. We really had we really had Bupinder get more uh popularity than Hobbs. That's that's kind of funny. Bandito makes an interest and they stare at each other. Actually, this one might not count for the story. Which, to be fair, I mean, it probably wouldn't do very much. And Ryan, Ryan Nemeth wins the main event against Thatcher. Wow. Uh, 63% show. Not bad. It's not, it's not great either, but honestly, it's not terrible. So. Ah, yes. Right. I still have... All the all the code changes, I still have all those. So, uh, yay, chaos. Excuse me. Um, let me just see. What is my production at? It's not bad. It's actually really not bad. It's actually pretty good. Um... <coughs> <coughs> So in fact, yeah, I'm still making quite a good, a good sum of money. The marketing will get taken out by the, the end of everything. Just want to go one day at a time. Actually, let me check. Yeah, the first one didn't count. It only counts if they're both a part of it. Hold on. Let me um was it a good idea to run that? Oh yeah, I made like fifty seven K. It was fine. <clears throat> Actually, let me run some numbers real quick. So uh seven seven four nine zero it's 21 bucks a ticket if it costs 20k to run that venue i have to sell at least 952 tickets to break even or i'd have to sell more than 952 tickets to break even so like that's not bad so if i were to sell 953 yeah, I'd at least... Yeah, okay. <clears throat> You're just running some numbers. I was like, is it worth it to do this? Blah, 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 blah. I'm like, no, it's... It's, uh... It's fine. <clears throat> Alright. 
So... Now, let's try to use the people that I didn't use on the show last week. Um, we'll give Bandito another match, obviously. We'll have Bandito go up against uh, Ace Austin. Because I know Ace, I know Ace Austin's got some good, some good stuff. Oh, he's actually not as good as I thought. Not, not, stat, stat's not as good as I thought. But, I have an idea. Um, by DQ. We'll lose by DQ. Bandito will look good, but I'm having I'm having Hobbs run interference by DQ. Yeah, fucking make Bandito look decent. Then we will continue with just more of more more of a Bandito just getting his ass beat. Um, we'll go with medium there. Uh, we'll max that with three extra minutes. There we go. Okay. From there... Yes, I am one hundred percent making. I would, I would prefer it if Hobbs T posed over him. Let me um. There we go. I have to, I have to include it. I have to include. I have to include it. Let's, uh, let's give Lee a match against Rocky Romero. Let's have Lee look, let's have, actually, I think, can I get away with, is that anyone? Yeah, I can. I can get away with making him steal the show. Cool. No. Oh. Whoopsie. Said Rocky Romero and Lee in about maybe maybe like a 15 minute contest. I think they can go that long. I guess because I like the sound of this match. <clears throat> um Voice. That's wow. Okay, so I'm trying to think. For the women, let's do actually. This will probably tank the angle score, but we're having. I'm gonna have Bailey just go out for a couple minutes and just say whatever. Mild risk. 
So he basically says... Then from there, we'll do I still haven't done like a women's match yet. So we'll do uh we'll do uh... We have run it before. This is the problem with having a roster this size. Like this is the this is the problem with having a roster this size is you run a lot of those matches more than once. But let's do let's do Kira Hogan and Kylie Ray, because why not? And we'll do that. And for the main event, let's do oh well, it's probably not gonna be the main event. Uh Let's just throw Zane Dawson and Simon Grimm in there for no reason other than I literally have no other option. I literally have no idea what I want to do. Let's run Rocky Romero and Lee Moriarty as the main event. How about that? <clears throat> yes. All right, this works. Bandito wins via DQ. Hob says, fuck you. I'm going to whoop your ass. Simon Grimm wins. Okay. You need to assert yourself at the top of the fucking card. What the hell? There you go. See, this is why you trust her to cut promos, because they're good. Lee wins. There you go. Like that. That was a good show. That was a good show. 65%. I like that. Oh. Ah yes, Jr. Kratos wants a <laughs> wants a title match. Well, guess who's going up against the uh, DPW Twitch champion Jordan Grace next week? That's what that's what Silicon Valley stupidity's for. We'll have we'll have Bailey have one more challenger at this next show, and then we'll bring in the new main event talent, and then we'll uh oh shit, you know what I realized. Oh, with the new signings and sh oh, with the frequency of signings upped. Actually, this might be this might not be bad. Oh, oh, it might be bad. You know what I just realized? Everyone here is on written contracts. Everyone here is on paper appearance contracts. Everybody. So f the problem with this is if WWE come in and say, "Hey, we want Bailey back. There is absolutely nothing stopping them from swooping in, giving her a written contract, and stealing her right from out under my nose. There is nothing stopping them from doing that. Unless I can hold on. Let me uh, let me just arbitrarily pick someone like uh, like uh, uh you. All right, let me just pick Cash Wheeler. I I can do monthly, monthly written contracts now. 10K is a lot of money. I will say that. I can do written contracts now. So, like, if I wanted to keep her around, I could absolutely be like, okay, I, I can 100% go like, okay. The only problem with that, I can go, I can give her a written contract and be like, she is mine. Only problem is... How much would that cost me? It's fourteen hundred per appearance already, so chances are it would cost me probably at least twenty, at least, if not more. Let's see. Yeah, twenty five. That's a lot. So, a twenty five k a month is quite a bit. Granted, like granted with uh, with merch with uh, I that I would get her. I would get merchandise sales for her too. That. That is something else to consider. 
with the financials, I make enough to support that. Like, I make enough to support that, but at the same time, it's like, uh, I, I don't know if I want, if I want to do that because like, I want to have a little bit of a safety. I want to have like a parachute before I do that. Actually, before I, before I do this, let me just go ahead and make sure that, uh, oh, is she still listed as, oh, that's my roster. That's why. Is she, okay, she's still unemployed. We just, we just pray that she stays unemployed so I can sign her for the next pay-per-view. Yes. Blech. Oh, hi, William. Okay. Oh, do I not have it so... Oh, pfft. Use your Prime sub then. <laughs> I should turn that off. I should, I should see if I can turn that off for, for moderators. I don't think I can, but... I don't know, man. If you use your Prime sub, you can... If you use your Prime sub, you can get it ad-free. No, I'm just kidding, but like... No, it, it, it does get it ad-free. Right. So, right off the bat, I'm dealing with Kratos's. I'm dealing with Kratos' title match. So, Kratos, Hogan, give him 10 minutes. DPW Twitch Championship. I'm going to see if I could just, uh, if I could just have Jordan Grace win. Like, if I could just have Jordan Grace win, that'd be great. Um, <clears throat> if not, then, uh, oh, I can. Cool. This is what I like about, this is what I like about Kratos, man. Just a uh, fucking California pro wrestling legend. He's a legend of the circuits up here. And he's just cool in all these saves. Like, he's never given me, like, any lip. He's never given me any trouble. He's always just accepted the results the way they go. And I like that. Like, a lot. I think, Bobcat, I know what the next story after Bandito is going to be for Will Hobbs. It's going to be Fatu. It's going to be Jacob Fatu. And I should probably get to thinking about who's going to dethrone Hobbs because, like, he's been world champion for a long time. Pretty much since I started. So, like, yeah. I should prob... I think he's been the champion literally the whole time. Let me go ahead and check that, actually. He has been... Oh no, Rocky Romero had it first. Rocky Rom Rocky Romero had it first. And then Hobbs beat him for it. And then yeah, he's had it for Hobbs has had it for a long time. It's it's about time. It's about time that he uh that he that he maybe drop it and he'll probably be dropping it to Jacob Fatu. Because is another is another another guy who's a uh, NorCal Pro Wrestling like icon he he's he's put in work in these parts he's put in work in these parts and uh i feel like i should probably uh probably recognize that Ooh, wait a minute do they have the other guy ah they don't have juicy finale ah damn that's a shame i hope they would have had a juicy finale because oh man, is another that's another Samoan re legend of wrestling around here. Uh, let me go ahead and uh, actually, am I? I am starting to get a little dark. Hold it. Let me just turn my lights on. My lights on. Let me get the other one too. Okay, there we go. That should be better. Excuse me, jeez. Let's uh, change this up. Do I have the... All the thing I do. I have all of the... Uh, I have a... I do have an idea for... I do have all the... Uh, all the stadiums and shit. Good. Needed to make sure. 
How much would I... Huh. 73K. I need to run a show at SAP first before I figure that out. That's for much later, though. Like, much later. Kratos versus Fatu's possibility for a story? Yeah. Yeah. Um, okay, so let's... Let's have good old... I haven't done a hooker Daniel Garcia yet. Let's do Dan Garcia, because Dan Garcia is actually not, like, terrible, stat-wise. Let's have Daniel Garcia take on... Dawson. Nine minutes. Yeah, that would, uh, yeah, that'd be a good idea. Let's, yeah, let's do that now. Uh, oh, no, Kr well, no, I'll have to do it next week because, uh, because Kratos is in a match already. Let's, uh, let's just put that ahead. Add match, Fatu, Kratos for 10? Let's go 10. Yeah, let's do that. We'll just have that there for when I, for when we get to book that show. <laughs> From there, let's do a ladies match. Who is my upper mid card equivalent to Kylie Ray? Who is the heel in the upper mid card? Mia Yim. Where is she? There she is. Let's give Mia Yim a match against not Willow. Not Willow. We're sick of seeing Willow lose. Let's give her a match against. Uh, I don't really want to give her a match against. You know what? I will give her a match against Brandy Loren. Do eight minutes there. Make me a yim look half decent. It's not hard. Stop. Stop it. Possibly? It's possible. We'll 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 see. We'll try. Let's do, let's do another nine. Let's see. Please, Roxy. Ah, yes. Yeah, she will be. Uh, as much as I don't... I don't exactly like to be pushed around. So, I gotta... Oh, uh, you know what? I think I gotta go with it anyway. I gotta... I gotta go with it anyway because of my whole I won't be bossed around attitude. And also, like, I gotta get these... I gotta get the... I gotta get the... Uh, I gotta get the the dick eating accusations off me. So, yeah, that's how I do it. That's how I do it. Um, let's um, let's do another thing. Interviewee. We need progression. Bandito interviewed by me myself. He's going to go with five minutes. Bandito is asked about last week's attack and swears. I'm good at writing segment notes, okay? Anyone who tells you otherwise is wrong. So we've got 19 minutes. Let's do... For no reason other than I want to... Oh, no. Nah, got it, got it, got it. Oh, Hobbs is technically supposed to be a good guy. Let's give Hobbs a match against Marco Stunt. Because... No, no, Hobbs is going to win that. Let's give Hobbs a match against uh, Marco Stunt. And let's do one more 10 minutes. 
with Ryan Nemeth and Lee. Oh, did I accidentally make it so Marco looked good? Oh, pfft, whoops. Thanks for pointing that out. Yeah, no, 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 no. You're, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. And this should be the show. Sorry, Roxy, but it, it's got to happen. We got to book, we got to start booking fucking, we got to start booking, uh, we got to start booking Willow to win. I'm sorry. Good. Mia actually won. Good. Zane Dawson beats Dan Garcia. Oh, jeez. Um, that like took a hatchet to her popularity. Holy crap. I didn't realize that it was going to do that much damage. Like I thought it was, I, I knew because obviously you're making the other one look damaged and you're making everybody else look bad, but I didn't think it look, I didn't think it'd be that bad. Um, yeesh. Uh, that's going to take a bit to, that's going to take a bit to reconcile, but, uh, and yep, Jordan Grace wins. Oh yeah, right. Cause I I I made him I made him win that. I mean, technically, I normally do it. I realize now that I normally do it with uh like skill. I normally do it based off wrestling skill, is how I determine where they are on the card. And I for some reason didn't do that this time. So let's uh. Sort by eh, wrestling skill. Yeah, technically. Yeah, the only thing that's... Kiera is lower, I think. I think Kiera is lower. I think Kiera is lower. And if she's not lower, she should be in lower. She is in lower. Okay. Oh, actually, I could just do this. Technically, she's in the right... Technically, Willow's in the right place. Compared to where everybody else is. Then Jordan Grace and Roxy are in the mid card. And then we've got Kylie Ray and Mia Yim in the upper mid card. And now, we just, like I said, we just need a... We just need a main event... Uh, we just need a main event face lady. And then we'll be, then we'll be all balanced and set to go. Which... I realize I'm dragging my feet on that, but, um, also, I just realized I have been, uh, I didn't remember what day was going to be the proto takeover. So, uh, uh, I'm going to have to check that in a bit. Okay, so where is, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it's the August 1st show. Actually, no, it's, um, it's this one. It's the 25th show. Yeah, exactly. That's, um, yeah, I get that. But like any given Sunday, I guess Hobbs respectfully, you're the world champion. So, like, he's going to be defending the title against Bandito anyway. He's going to be defending the title against Bandito on the 25th show anyway. So, like, we'll just we'll just pencil that in now so I don't have to do it. DPW, that's the wrong championship. Um, we'll give him 20. Well, obviously, it's going to be a... It's going to be a uh, Does Hobbs have the wrestling skill to make that? That's the wrong one. He does. He has 75. I didn't think it was that high. Nope. Wrong one. Nope. Nope. We're stealing shows. Um. Yes. Okay. So... 
I'll, I'll appease Roxy somehow. Um... So the episode of DBW Fisticuffs that's going on today is we're running Fatu versus Kratos, baby. Bay Area Legend versus <laughs> Bay Area Pro Sports Legend. Yeah, Bay Area Pro Wrestling Legend versus Bay Area Pro Wrestling Legend. Shh. That's not, that's not how I'm trying to look, bruh. That's not how it's supposed to look. Yeah, she's probably not a big fan of me right now. Um, actually, let me let me just take a take a quick look. Yeah, everything's fine. See, it's it's just everything's fine. Nothing's negative, so like nobody it says nobody's in a bad morale right now, so everything's fine. Sure, she's probably still a teeny bit miffed that I. She's probably a. If anything, she's probably not as high as everybody else is on morale, but it's like it's not bad. Granted, it is it is not positive. It's currently not exactly uh not exactly as positive, but uh whatever. She'll learn to live with it. I'll I'll get her I'll I'll get her a win this week. Against, I think both Hogan and Loren would be upset if I made Roxy beat them. Like at some point, it's just pissing off one person to. It's it's pissing off one person to appease another. Oh, look at that! Kira Hogan being civil about a loss. Who would have thought? Not me. That's for sure. Um. Then we'll go with um I think I haven't used Masters or Hook yet. I haven't used Brody King yet either. I'll use Brody King on this show. Give them like six minutes. Whoever wins wins. This is not gonna be a this is not gonna be a good match. I'll let it go out on for I'll let it go out first. Um, ooh, idea, competitors, bandito, oh, ah, yeah. I would do Brody King, but, uh, no, that's going to derail it. Actually, I could make him look good in defeat and have Hobbs, like, interfere. So Brody King win, uh... I could I could realistically make it steal the show between these guys. Oh no, not steal the show. Then we gotta make Bendito look good in defeat. Hobbs runs interference. Actually, I wouldn't exactly say clean. I wouldn't exactly call it clean. I gotta start distinguishing between that. Um, I think I'm gonna have. Uh, I think I'm gonna have Will Hobbs attack. Uh, I'm gonna have Will Hobbs uh, attack Bandito again.
No, no, it, it needs to be like this. And then for the last 14 minutes, let's do Lee and Speedball. For no reason other than to... I mean, probably, but I haven't used Hook yet. <clears throat> I haven't used Hook yet in this stream, and I want to use him. So I'm, I'm going to use him. We'll have Lee go on. We'll have that. I want to use everybody. I think Hobbs is... I think... No. I think Hook was literally the only person that I didn't... I hadn't used yet. So... I was going to go with that. Okay. That's good. I mean, two stars. Eh, it's fine. Okay. Good. 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 67 and 64. Okay. I mean, it was fine. I just gotta go. I gotta go through and make sure. Forty one hundred, almost forty two hundred. I gotta go and make sure that uh, nobody gets poached from me. That's the only problem with doing it like this is I gotta make sure that nobody fucking. I gotta make sure that nobody gets poached from me. Because I think the only one that's on a written contract is me. Like actually, me. I think it's me. Oh, the Sharks are playing right now? Gross. Um, <clears throat> okay. Nobody's doing anything. Nobody's Nobody's been poached for me yet. Okay. Nobody's been poached for me yet. So, <clears throat> I'm going to go to the bathroom, and then I'm going to, then we'll continue. Whoop. We've been doing good so far. we go and we are once again good to go okay <clears throat> so we got nothing for this show the only show that we have anything for is the proto takeover in two weeks Well, proto takeover is what I normally call uh, the the pay per views in between pay per views. <sighs> okay. 
What are my financials looking like for the month already? Not a whole hell of a lot, but to be fair, there was a pay-per-view this month. So, yeah, that makes sense. There was a pay-per-view this month, but <clears throat> surprisingly, I didn't get anything for net. <laughs> right, because of the way the because of the way that shit works now. Right, it's, it's annoying with the way the networks thing works now. I don't I don't know how it works anymore. These are all, uh, like for instance, I want, uh, like. <clears throat> I want to do something like this. This is the only thing is this is the problem. It costs way too much. That's the only problem. It's just extra. It's just extra money that I don't really have yet. So, I gotta be smart about it. Although, I actually, I actually will run JTG and Chris Masters. Just to see what happens. Because that was, that was thrown around. Let's do... I mean, yeah, technically, but like, yeah, see, I'm still confused with how this works. Like, I don't know how it works. I need to, I need to take some extra time and like figure out how the network stuff works because I have no clue. Um, let's. Let's do, let's do Chris versus, no, let's do Chris versus uh, Dawson, want some heel on heel action, because why the hell not, then let's do, Thatcher versus Hobbs with some bandito interference. Then we'll do... Did I do women yet? No. <clears throat> Let's do... No, no, not not in the run-ins. Let's do Bailey versus... Uh... Let's do 
It's it's invalidating another one of our fucking competitors, even though they're like super limited. Then let's do Nemeth and uh, Fatu for ten, and I'll uh, I'll uh, extend one of these by five more minutes. Let's do it with let's just do it with these two. <clears throat> yeah, this is not one of the uh, the better shows that I've booked in terms of like on paper shit that's going on, but like <clears throat> no Hobbs one anyway. Yeah, it's fine. Oh, I'm having him defended it next week. Okay. Nice. Um, all right, let's do a network. Let's do a network deal. Then she's only interested. Then uh, it was it was this one. I think I did. It was um. Which one was the one that was f- this one? This one, right? Yeah. Um. <clears throat> For monthly, annual, and premium events, those pay-per-views. So, um, let's do one year for this just to see how it goes. I kind of want to see, um... I kind of want to see what, uh... I kind of want to see what, uh like TV deals we could do feasibly not not uh not many Monday Tuesday Monday Thursday uh Thursday would be it's NXT UK fuck you um is there anything that's not that's South America though KGW uh, of course okay this one what have we got here Oh damn! Thursday. How much would this cost me? That's the problem. Yeah, I know. I um, it doesn't give me a choice. To, it doesn't give me a choice to uh change it though. The only the only weird thing is that it doesn't give me a choice to change it. Yeah, that's weird. Um, I think I'm gonna try the, I'm gonna try the oh income per show. Hey, yeah, let's try that. Yeah, it doesn't give me, it didn't give me a chance to, it didn't give me a choice to change that. So we'll give the we'll give this um we'll give this TV thing a try. And if this goes way down, I'm going to have to cancel it. It it shouldn't, but I don't know. It's a learning experience. Yeah, I guess that, that's weird. Maybe it's just a okay. It didn't go way down. Let me go ahead and let me just let me just uh, let me view another network. Let me see. Let me do pay per view network. Let me see. Um, there started. Wow. Um, let me just see. Like Gold Life South America. Let me just see. So if I were to change this, yeah. See, it doesn't give me an, it doesn't give me an option to change it. 
So, like, if I were to just go, like, oh, there's uglies by the bay. It's, see, it doesn't give me an option to change. That's weird. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Woo. Fisticuffs on Thursday, baby. Let's go. It means we got our first, uh, this is our first show. Woo. All right. DP dubs on TV, baby. Woo. Um, we got to put on a good one. Except I'll probably, uh, I'll hold back just a bit, if anything. Except there's one thing I will do. There's one match that I will run. I'm going to run uh, Thatcher and Romero. This is always a good one. Um, we'll do... Who do I want challenging Bailey next week? I don't remember who I said I wanted to challenge Bailey next week. Um, I'll probably just have someone... I'll probably just have someone challenge. Or I don't... It's It's pretty much arbitrary. It'll probably be whoever wins this match. Yeah, you know what? Fuck it, I'm gonna do that. I have to do it with no... I have to do it with no, uh... I have to do it with no risk now because... Because I have a TV deal now. Oh, it's gonna... Oh, I'm, uh... There I am. There I am. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There. Got it. Get excited. Then we'll do Grim and Nemeth for no reason other than I want it. And then we'll do... Um... Then we'll do... JTG and uh, and Dawson for no reason other than yes. Eh, I don't think we do. I don't think we do. I think I. I think. Yeah, it's whatever. I mean, we still can be. Impact is still on TV, and they still stream on Twitch. So, eh. If anything, it acknowledges our roots. So I'm keeping it. All right. Eighty-six percent. See, man, I'm good. I'm good. We got a TV deal, bitches. Get excited. Sent BAM wins again. And what a surprise. They have a fucking absolute belter. All right. Oh, three mil. Holy shit. Look at that. That's some ratings right there. Holy shit. <laughs> Damn, bruh. Let's go. We fucking outdid NXT UK. We fucking... Oh, where's uh, the North America? North America? One mil. We fucking pecker slapped NXT UK in the ratings. 
Like I like I literally have no other word for it. We pecker slapped them. Yes, we have run Thatcher versus Romero like four million times. I literally did it specifically so it could be my workhorse matchup. So yeah. We absolutely fucking ruined NXT UK in the ratings in our first week. One million sixty nine thousand two hundred and four to three million two hundred and two thousand and eighty. We, f- I'm sorry. We we pecker slapped them. I literally have no no word for that. I, li- I have no other word. Realistically, um, let me check the network deal again. We're making 165k per show. Let me just go ahead and do one thing really quick. 165k per show. That's per show. That's uh, a lot. So, guess what I'm going to do? Yeah! Um, here's the deal, WWE. I'm keeping her as a heel, by the way. Um, here's the thing, WWE. Yeah, you can't steal her from me anymore. She is mine now for realsies. I told myself I wasn't going to do it, but then it's like, 25k per month, and then I make it 165k per show... There's like four of them in each month. So like, I really have no excuse anymore. <laughs> I have no excuse anymore. So, uh, woo is good. This is a good one. <laughs> Actually, I should probably check and make sure that she's not getting both PPA and the 25k per month because that would not be ideal that's that's a lot of money that's just going out like that it's a lot so i gotta go and make i should probably make sure she's not getting both <laughs> they can't take her from me oh wait let me uh let me just go to let me just do all promotions i think it'll i think it'll tell me no well, what am i doing no i gotta go to the database for this DP dub. What do we got here? Nope. It's no longer PPA. And also I get all the merch money. <laughs> yes. So, so it turns out that these uh, written contracts, when you got TV deals, man, they, uh, they're worth it. Okay. Um, so it was Mia Yim and Bailey again. As much as I don't want it. No, 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 no. Bailey wins. Bailey wins. Um, I'm gonna make Bailey retain it because we gotta have a. Because we gotta have a. We gotta have the new person come in. We gotta have the new person come in and uh. Can I give them both twenty? Can I? Uh, what is uh seventy two eighty three? I probably can. Seventy eight eighty seven. Yes, I can. Ladies, I love you. Um, and then for Jordan Grace, I don't have a match for her, like specifically. So here's what I'm going to do. I think I'm just going to do an intergender fail four way and we'll go from there. So we'll have Jordan Grace, uh, Roxy. We'll just do it with we'll just do it with mid carters. Jordan Grace, Roxy, not Fatu. Uh, yeah, no, let's do Kratos and not Bandito because Bandito's already taken. Actually, it might it might have to be Fatu. It might have to be Fatu actually. Um, oh no, we'll do uh, Dawson. Um, DPW Twitch Championship. Um, no, because we're, we're, we're going to probably make Jacob Fatu take the world championship off of Hobbs. I don't want him to be a double champ. Fuck you. I don't want him to be a double champ. So, uh, cause I don't like having double champs. So it was Grace, Roxy, Dawson, and Kratos. 20 minutes is going to be a fucking stretch for like 
Oh, this this match is probably gonna be a fucking train wreck. This match is probably gonna be a fucking train wreck. All right, obviously this is gonna be uh like that. Um, yeah. I think I will have I'll have um Bailey do that though. Actually, if we're gonna have a if we're gonna position um if we're gonna position uh Fatu to take the belt the belt off of Hobbs, as much as it's gonna hurt the morale. Oh, as much as it's gonna hurt Hobbs' morale, and he's not gonna like it. I think I gotta do it that way. Okay, this is the show. This match, this first match, probably gonna suck. Fifty-seven. Eh, yeah, I figured. Uh, yeah, struggling for breath. That's. And she defended it. By the way, she won the match. Bailey wins in a four-star contest, and. Hobbs win Hobbs wins in a four and a half star contest. That's good for on TV show, bruh. <laughs> 69 funny sex number. Let's go. Good shit. Good shit. Made almost 85k in in the manis. This is the thing now we're gonna see my pop we're gonna see the popularity skyrocket now. Four mil. Four point two million. Wow. Now that is some good shit. Okay, now we almost have the build up to Silicon Valley stupidity, which good. Very good. Um I want to go see event history 3.2 mil on the first episode. This one had zero viewership because it doesn't have, I had no TV deal. And then I got a TV deal and all of a sudden everything just fucking broke wide open for me. Let me just, uh, okay. I don't have enough information available. They're calculated at the end of the month, which means very soon. Very good. Very, very good. <sighs> it did. Surprise, 4.2 mil. All right, let's see what we got. Did good. We definitely we definitely upped it in the merch game. Thanks, Bailey. You I really owe you one. Let me just go ahead. Booyah. 35k right off the bat. That's already uh and that thing, that was like half the month. Fuck yeah, dude. Hell yeah. So uh, yeah, and I'm starting to figure out how this game actually works again. Woohoo! So many different updates, so many updates, so little time, but now I'm starting to slowly figure it out again. Okay. Now, it's probably a good time to make sure that my, that my woman of choice is not signed by anybody. That's not how you spell that. She's not signed. Perfect. And, oh, look, the existing relationship with me and Yim is already there. Booyah, bitch! Let's go. Um, okay, so only 5k per month. Oh, girl, I love ya. I, I fucking love ya. Although, I will have to say, she is based, she's still based in Wales, even though she lives in Florida. But, you know what? 5k per month for Nick's dad, that, that works for me. That works for me. Booyah. There you go. That's another written contract for me. Only 5k a month. That, that doesn't seem legal. It feels like it should be more than that. It feels like it should be more than that, right? 
Fucking boom. That is what we call some shrewd business work, baby. Let's go. Also, Joey, I saw your request. I'll, uh, I'll up that on a... Oh, he's not here. Oopsie. I might as well do it now. Like, what am I doing? Not a whole lot. Yeah, fine. Okay. Yeah, I know, dude. Fucking hell. And also, dude, again, just fucking 5K per, 5K per month, and that makes it so the Fed can't steal her from me. Which is the best part. And my roster's now completely balanced out. I have an even number again. And look! Ah, it's so good! I love it! Let's go! Oh, um, I gotta, I gotta... So the final world championship storyline. So the best the best angle of the whole thing was the actual match itself. So at least we can say that. This was an all right project, I would say. But we got to move on to the new one. We got to move on to the next one. 65, 65 heat. Considering that a lot of... Uh, considering that... No, at what point do I implement a tag scene? When I have more money. <laughs> um, I don't know. Um, now let's do Hobbs. That's fat and fat too. Yes. I'm proud of myself. We did that. Five, five thousand? Really? Fuck it. That's. Five thousand is fucking. That feels. That feels low. Like, I can't, I can't get over that. That feels like really, really low. Like, that feels low. And they're the only two that I have on guaranteed contracts. So I've got about 30K committed in a, I had about 30K committed in a, in monthly contracts now. Considering the fact that like, I've seen this, I've seen the AI pay like enhancement talent, literally like 4K and X and also shit on appearance, getting a talent like Nixon Newell for only 5k per month with no extra on appearance. That's that's good. That's good business, bro. Shit, she comes she's fucking fantastic. Oh man, I have won this. See, the only people I really got to worry about I think this is false by the way. Um, the only thing I really got to worry about, I got to worry about, um, not getting poached from me. I had to worry about me, I have to worry about, uh, probably I have to worry about me, I'm now, you know what? She's on, she's on a PPA with AEW. So probably not. I might have to worry about me, I'll probably have to worry about Rocky Romero. I have to probably worry about um, Timmy Thatcher, and that's and I might have to worry about Hobbs. I might have to worry about Hobbs. I don't know off the top of my head yet, but I might have to worry about that. Man, that's a uh, long time since that ha that since that's happened. Um, but yeah, I might have to worry about Hobbs. I um, yeah, that's true. I might have to worry about Hobbs. There are only a few people. I'll have to worry about Lee Moriarty at some point because 
he grows like fucking crazy working for this many promotions. So, yeah, that's the best part about it. Um, yeah, Lee grows like fucking crazy. I might have to worry about Brody King too at some point. But I definitely need to be like, I definitely need to worry about Lee the most out of everybody here. Except for maybe Mia Yim, because, like, obviously the Fed's going to be sniffing around. And Lee just grows like fucking crazy. So, I think it's a cigar. I mean, it looks like a cigar to me. Let me, let me see. Oh, no, I think, no, it is a mouth guard. It is a mouth guard. It's interesting, I didn't. I never really like stop to take a good look at it. Um Yeah, it, it is a mouth guard, but it looked like a cigar from like far away. Should we be getting everybody on on pay per appearance contracts now? Like uh, everybody on a uh, signed contracts now? No. No. What makes you think that? Although realistically, I probably could stand. No wait, we scored a second. Excuse me, dude. The NHL app sucks at getting notifications out. I'm gonna just say that right now. Because sometimes I get the end of the period notification with the score before I get the score update. Like, what the fuck? How did that happen? Yes. This is another reason that I that I jumped on it as soon as I did. Because this pre-existing relationship was there and that can only help morale. Everybody's in good spirits. Everybody's in a great... Everybody's in a great mood, baby. Let's go. Um. Okay, so now I'm thinking about it. Um, that's what 30, how much am I paying Bailey again? Let me just make sure. I think it's, it's 25 point something, 25.2. That's then I'm paying 30.2 for the whole thing. And I'm getting 165 per show on getting 160, 165.7 per show. And there's at least seven show. There's at least four shows per Like, and um, it's 165.7 per show. There's usually four shows every month. One, two, three, four, five. There's five shows per month normally. So five shows per month, that's 1.6. That's one. Uh, I should probably be writing this down, huh? Uh, you know what? This is uh, where we're doing this now. Um, okay. Okay. So, it's 165.7. Uh, this rev per show, show, month, that's five. And then I can actually just, uh, then that would be. That's total revenue per month from a TV deal is just 828k alone. So So expenditure in so the expenditure on um production which is 30k per month which is um which is 30k per month and written contracts is another 30k per month uh production prod flat 
and then extra two. Let me do um, um <clears throat> then um it would be total production would be C six times uh C seven times C three. Oh no, this wouldn't be a this wouldn't be uh it would be it'd be plus. Okay, so that's um on written contracts and then wait, no, this is um not revenue, this is income. I'm really di I'm digging deep into my I'm digging deep into my accounting stuff now. I'm like I'm digging deep into my accounting classes. Um actually let me just uh I'm digging deep into my accounting classes now. Uh rev rev per month that's uh total income per month total I guess it should be total flat income per month. Total flat income per month. That's C4 minus uh, C8 plus C10. I just trying to. I'm trying to visualize. I'm trying to visualize just how much I'm making. Three quarters of a million dollars a month. So I think I can definitely. I can definitely afford to, to maybe spend a little more money. And this this also does not factor in pay-per-view revenue. This is just flat revenue that I'm guaranteed to to move every single month. So uh man, Ag would be fucking Ag would be proud of me, dude. And seeing seeing me working with numbers and working with numbers like this and shit. There, we'll uh, we'll actually like format this like uh, that's percent. No, that's not money. Um, this one is money actually. I should probably uh, yeah, actually this one is money. Um, these ones are also money. So is this, and so is this. Okay. <sighs> Most mostly, it's uh that. So we're in a pretty good spot. Let me just actually zoom in so I can uh highlight this a little bit better. Yeah, um, I really shouldn't be moneyballing this thing like I am because this TV deal is fucking like helped me a lot. This t this TV deal is helping me a lot. I mean, we're we're living and dying by this TV deal because as soon as this goes by the wayside, like if this goes to nothing, we're in the hole. Like seriously, in the hole. Yeah, because if that goes by the wayside, we're in the fucking hole. That's for sure. So we're doing pretty well for ourselves. I'm gonna wait just a little bit longer. To maybe boost production just a teeny bit. I'm gonna wait a little bit more. I'm gonna wait maybe just a teeny bit more to to like go nuts. Mm-hmm. Well, to be fair, not everything was going to shit. Not everything was going to shit without TV. Because we were we were running just fine without it, like we were just running fine without it, but we didn't really take the we didn't take the uh, we didn't take that next step. But now that we have the TV, now that we have the TV deal, it's a uh, who baby. We've got a lot of money coming in now. Let's see if I can just go in here, you can see it's like. 
We're, we're doing well. Okay. The only thing that sucks is that I also have to pay, uh, I have to pay Nixon's, uh, travel expenses. So it's like, and because it's out, outside of the home continent, it's an extra K, but like 6K to book, like, just an extra K to book, like one K to book Nixon on a show and five K and five K a month to have her as my, like ex- as to have her exclusively to exclusive to DPW. That's fine. I can take that. Cons- especially considering I'm making fucking three quarters of a million dollars every month. <laughs> they're one, they're questioning. He's on so little a month. Why is he not paying himself? Little do they know. That he is paying himself. Like, he is paying himself. Just not the same way he's paying everyone else. When he doesn't have to pay the the paper... He doesn't have to pay the pay-per-view deals. And he doesn't have to pay the venue people, the production staff, everything, blah, 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 blah. All the revenue that I don't have to pay to people is going back to me. I own this bitch. He's like, and I... Like, I own this bitch... So everything in this ba- so everything in this balance is technically in my pocket. If you want to be like if you want to be legit, if you want to be real about this for a sec, two and a half years in, I made seven million dollars. It's like everything that's not going to other wrestlers or other than that, that's all me, bro. This is all mine. This is just, this is just all mine. So like I don't know, man. I'm just saying I I no business, sort of. So one, two, three, four. Okay, yeah. Normally, okay. So normally there are about four to five shows every month. Normally there are about four to five shows every month. Um, let's. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna just do this. Basically, gonna uh copy that, paste it over here. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna copy these and there's normally it's either five per month or four per month. So I'm gonna just do this just so I can kind of visualize what's going on. That extra show definitely helps. It, but it is less in production, so I mean for for four show months. That's not bad at all. Hmm. I'm doing well. I'm doing just fine for myself. I don't know why I'm just by by default running it like it's Moneyball. Mainly because actually it's probably because mainly because when you don't when you don't run uh, this database when there were no networks, there's like, in the database that I have normally, it's only, there's only like maybe six or seven networks. There's only like six or seven networks and all the big, and all the big, uh, all the big, uh, what's it calls are, um, all the big promotions are already like on them. So it's like, I can't really do a whole lot. And they're already in exclusive negotiations with other fucking, with other promotions. So I can't do it. Well, we'll we'll see how pay-per-views go. Yeah, in a way, if I wanted to, I could. But, like, I still want to, like, I'm still going to, like, kind of ease off a teeny bit. Just because, just because I have all this money doesn't mean that I want to fucking absolutely blow all of it to smithereens. So, let's, um, it's 7.03, it's, uh, 17.03, let's, um, here, I'll do this, and then we'll, um, I might, hold on. I might have Bailey wrestle Willow. Not for the women's title though. As much as I as much as I um 
as much as we I know we want Willow to start winning, but it leads into it. Bailey starts talking, flapping her gums and shit. And that is when a certain Nixon Newell makes her fucking debut, baby. Wherever the hell she is in the list. There she is. There she is. There you go. We could, but like, yeah, we only 100% could. Yeah, let's go with that. Fuck it. Like, oh, shit. It's like, oh, my God. We have a new per like holy shit like I'm just I imagine I'm on commentary with Mauro and I'm like oh my goodness it's Nick's uh, new I'm trying to pretend like I didn't go <laughs> I didn't do contract negotiations <coughs> oh I'm being called I'll be back Bleh.
That is way too Michael Cole sounding for me. I'd, I'd like to imagine that it w- wouldn't sound like that. Okay. Let's book fisticuffs. I haven't booked do then speedball and um fat two for ten. Yeah, let's, uh, yeah, we'll do that. I haven't used Brody King yet in this episode. Actually, no, I think I probably ha- I have used Brody King in this episode, in this stream, but I want to do it again. Yeah, let's go with that. Yeah, that's the only thing with having such a weak, uh, it's like, four stars, goddamn. Nice. Nice. These never normally work for me. Nice. I like that. Okay. Three point nine. Damn. An extra ninety, extra ninety k on top of the shit we just made from. Woo, baby. That's yeah. We got time. I mean, well, again, it's the nature of having a small roster. You, uh, you kind of have to run some shit more than once. Make sure. All right. Nobody's gotten poached yet. We're good. Not even my refs. We're good. I like to come back to this page every so often, make sure everything's in good standing. And it is. Good. Very good. (laughs) I think I'll probably do one more show and then we'll be good to go for today.
Yeah, he's right there. He is fourth in the rankings. He did just beat Bandito, and he has gone up with Brody King already, so. Yeah, so I guess, uh. I guess Fatu is the next uh, logical step. Nope, wrong way. There we go. Nope, that one. There we go. Seventy? That's not bad. I should probably get Fatu a, a good win. Then we'll do Fatu and let's do yeah. We'll do Dawson heel on heel heat heel on heel action. Nah, maybe not 15. 12. <laughs> we'll do... <clears throat> I don't even remember what I've run this episode. Okay, this episode I've made her. I've ran Sky Blue, Roxy, and Bailey. Realistically, I'll probably have her. I'll probably have her beat. Uh, I don't care how pissy she gets at me. I'm gonna have her beat Brandy. I don't care. She's gonna get pissy at me, but I don't care. That like, girl, you are literally enhancement talent. Get the hell out of here. Oh, I gotta give. I gotta have uh, Nixon have her uh, her in ring debut. Shit. Let's do. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do Nixon versus Kira Hogan as her first match in a DPW ring. And for the last. Let's do Lee and Bandito. Because yes. Yes. Good. We love Willow. I am getting myself over too. <laughs> no wins and so does Bandito. Nice. We do. We do love Willow. Not Paul London 4.2 a killing NXT UK in the ratings again. Woohoo! 40, uh, 4,600. Surprised. Let's um, <clears throat> simulate ahead to the next uh, 
simulate ahead to the next show, and then we'll be uh, we'll be good to go. Cut it there. Cut it at that. <clears throat> Although I will say I'm very curious to see how uh I'm very curious to see how uh <coughs> what's it called is gonna go how the pay per view is gonna go. Okay. It's the next show. We are now at a good enough spot. At this point, let me just go one more time. <sighs> wow. It's been two weeks and we've already almost like equaled that. God damn. Doing fairly well for ourselves, seems like. All right. You actually did some work with DPW this time. Who would have thought? Uh, Sunday, tomorrow, I'll be back early for a fun little thing that we're gonna do in a. We're gonna do in Football Manager tomorrow. It's uh, it's gonna be interesting. I suggest you come by and check that out. So, uh, bye bye. Thank you for showing up. And I will see you guys tomorrow morning. Bye-bye. Woo! Short, but sweet. And it, it actually was pretty pretty good. <laughs> <laughs>